Good evening. Hello, everyone. Thank you all for being here. This is the closing night of the 47th edition of the Toronto International Film Festival. Thanks so much for coming. You know, it's, uh, it's been a great festival. Uh, these days have gone by so quickly, and we're so grateful to have been able to share this with you, the best audience in the world. Thank you so much for coming back. <laughs> Uh, when we started this year, it was far from a sure thing that we could bring you the festival that you've seen over the past 10 days. But our team worked to build a festival that we all needed this year. Our partners, both private and public, organizations and individuals, they all came back with the support that we needed after two tough years. It's been two tough years for all of us. The industry was back, buying and selling movies, shaping opinions of movies. The filmmakers brought us films that were gorgeous and gripping and hilarious and crazy and every adjective you can think of. And the result was an amazing experience, a love letter to Toronto and our audiences. And now I would like to welcome two terrific new members of our senior team to the stage. Please join me in welcoming Anita Lee, Chief Programming Officer, and Beth Jansen, Chief Operating Officer of TIFF. Thank you so much, uh, Cameron. And, um, Anita and I are so um, happy to be here. I, I cannot, we're in shock that all of that happened <laughs> over that period of time. Um, but we really want to thank um, some key people who made this festival happen. First and foremost, there is an army of people who make this festival happen every year. They are behind the scenes and not in front of the camera, and they are the true unsung heroes of this festival. So please, let's give a round of applause for our incredible festival staff. Thank you also to our lead and major sponsors, Bell, RBC, Bulgari, and Visa, and our major public supporters, the Government of Canada, the Government of Ontario, Telefilm Canada, and um, the Government of the City of Toronto. Um, thank you, so yes, please give it up for the government. It's Cameron's joke. Uh, thank you so much to the beautiful Visa screening room at the Princess of Wales Theatre. It's a beautiful space to watch a film together. We would, of course, like to also acknowledge our major industry supporters, Ontario Creates and Telefilm Canada, for their unwavering support. We welcome thousands of industry members to the festival this year. We could not be more excited. Thank you to our major industry trade partners, Variety, The Hollywood Reporter, and Screen International. And thank you, of course, to our generous donors and members. Thank you to our board of directors and to Jeffrey Remedios, who in his first year as board chair has truly helped push us forward in our mission to transform the way people see the world through film. We would also like to acknowledge the immeasurable contribution of the founders of the Toronto International Film Festival, Bill Marshall, Dusty Cole, and Hank Vanderkolk. And now to the film. Tonight's closing night film, Dally Land, by filmmaker Mary Heron, is both an homage to the eccentric artist Salvador Dali and an expose of art world corruption. The film portrays the fascinating relationship between Dali and his partner, Gala, bringing a fresh perspective on an art world icon. Thank you, Zephyr Films. We could not be prouder that Heron is a Canadian filmmaker who is a trailblazer herself with such iconic films like I Shot Andy Warhol and American Psycho. Dali Land is her latest film. It is my great pleasure to welcome Mary Heron. Thank you so much. TIFF does have the greatest audiences. It's uh, wonderful to be back in my 
old hometown and uh, to have some of my family and friends in the audience here. Um, this film took nine years to, to get made, uh, which is long even by independent film, and it's, it's a thrill to, also, to be here. Um, I'm very sad to say that uh, Sir Ben Kingsley, who's been here, um, came down with COVID a couple of days ago, but he has prepared a, a video message for you um, after, after this. Um, and um, the great Barbara Sokova, who plays Gala, broke her ankle, so <laughs> she's in Brooklyn. But we do have some wonderful actors here um, from our young cast, so I'd like to introduce them. <laughs> The greatest part of making this film, um, any film, but particularly this film, was working with the wonderful cast, who were so fantastic, and including two actors who had never been in a film before. Um, Christopher Briney, uh, straight from Grammar Grand School, who plays James. <laughs> Zachary Nakbar Seckel, who you will see in a beard, uh, play, <laughs> and straight hair, who plays Jeff Fenholt, which you'll love. <laughs> Andrea Pezik, who plays Amanda Lear. <laughs> and Avatar Lavova, who plays Young Gala. Um, this is a great honor. Thank you, to, thank you to everyone at TIFF, to our wonderful producers, Ed Pressman, who I've worked with for, for 25 years, who actually also has COVID. Uh, it's, re it's very sad, but let us, let's celebrate anyway. And very, they're with us in spirit, as is Delhi, I hope. Okay. <laughs>